Today is Juneteenth. It's the celebration of the last remaining slaves that they were informed that the Civil War was over and there was an end to slavery. With the world's focus now on race, some uh, workplaces, a lot of them in fact, are giving people today the day off work. Many taking time to learn about black history. And on your side, Renata De Gregorio tonight is showing us why you're invited to Durkeyville today. This section here is called the Lost Neighborhoods. The walls of the Durkeyville Historical Society are covered in history, reflecting the world outside them. But it's a history often overlooked, like Juneteenth. Some of them will be the first time they've ever heard of it. Lloyd Washington, the president of the Historical Society, has hope. Does this Juneteenth feel different? Yes, it actually does because of uh, what's going on in Jacksonville, that the Jacksonville Jaguars gave all their employees today off where they could learn more about Juneteenth. Uh, this is his actual jersey. Beyonce Knows was at uh, Ocella, and she sung the song, Lift Every Voice and Sing. And for them, that was the first time a lot of them have ever heard the song. And the song is over 100, 125 years old. So it's a fact that a lot of our history are not in books. We're not being taught um, our history. We're being taught everybody else's history. So yes, we need to learn our own history and be proud of it. 